Good morning everyone. Um, I am into my second um, month, well I've just come up to the second month of testing with Red X. My last, I suppose it was four weeks, has been uh, after the cleaning, uh, the five in one, full on, full dose of Red X power. Now, I had a drop in uh, miles per gallon. Uh, which I'll write about in my blog, so um, check out the link for that. And there's a few factors that I can think of. One being, it's been really hot, so the aircon has been on a bit more. Um, the second one has been, I've been doing probably shorter journeys. Um, and I've also had the windows open quite a lot. I saw my uh, average MPG over that time drop to 50.3. So that's not very good at all. But that's fine, um, you know, I've put on the forums uh, about it and I've also said, you know, this car is, it's an old car, it's on 70,000 miles, will the cleaning, um, you know, deposit all those all those soots and, and deposits back and reduce the MPG. So, I've just filled up to keep the test nice and uh, conformed, I've filled up with uh, let me see where it is. There it is. I don't know if you can see that. Let me uh, zoom in. Uh, don't know if you can see that, but exactly 50 litres of fuel. It's saying 50 litres for a bottle. I did 50 litres for the last one. Uh, for, for the five-in-one solution. So now um, it's time to put the Red X in. Wish me luck everyone, hopefully I'll get much better MPG this time, um, fingers crossed. Hi everyone, just a little disclaimer, um, I wasn't on the forecourt uh, when I was filming off or putting the Red X in. If you have a look here, uh, I'm in a, a lay-by where they do the air, so well away. 